And oh, what it is, here it is, December the 7th, and I'm going to tell you about my day. It's already late in the afternoon, and I was going to town early this morning to my little quilt shop, and I was going to start a new project, and I did, but the quilt shop doesn't open till 10 o'clock, and so I didn't get, didn't leave the house very early, but before I went, I was going to find a pattern that I wanted to make, so I found the, found this lovely pattern. I can't even show you that. That's another story, but I found this pattern that I wanted to make. And I bought it and downloaded it, and then I couldn't get my printer to work to print that pattern that I wanted to sew because you know I'm making a quilt. <sighs> so I was on a tear around the house trying to get things to work and trying to figure out a way I could get my get get it so I could get it to town to find the fabrics for it. <sighs> I never did, but I went to town anyway. I took this bag that Tarsha gave me. And I've got my fabrics. I'll show you some of my fabrics. This is some of it. That one has, it says, the large outside border. And there's another little piece. I'll show you these. And then I'll tell you all about it. I got this, what they call layer cake, to make my hearts. My The pattern I'm making is going to have hearts. I got more pieces. I'll have to show you the, all the, the pattern later. But you know, silly me, silly me, went to town. My friend at the quilt house cut all these fabrics for me, figured out my ticket, and I started to, was going to pay her, and I didn't have my checkbook. <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of old school. I still write a check and pay with things, and I didn't have that checkbook, and so I couldn't pay her, and she said it was okay, and I could pay her later, but, and I brought my stuff home, and then I, I t fed Terry some lunch, because it was, it was after lunchtime, but he needed to eat, so I fed him lunch, got my checkbook, and I went back to town. Now, I'm about 10, 12 miles out of town, so I went to, drove into town, got got this this fabric for this quilt, then come home, fed Terry lunch, and then went back to town. And then I was going to go to the grocery store, so I went to the grocery store the second time. But and so I've been I've been on a run around. I get scatterbrained sometimes and don't know whether I'm coming or going. You ever not feel like if you're coming or going? But I've got the stuff. Got the stuff for my for my quilt. That's so that's pretty. Put this red put that red one with it. Gonna it's gonna have hearts in it. Making it for the some old friends in our my community when, for the reunion. I'm gonna give it away at the reunion. Anyway, that's been my day. What else? Oh, I brought my groceries in. I put my groceries away. I need to sit out and rest now. Get my head cleared out before I start cutting this. We've got my since it, my printer here at my house didn't work. I sent it to my daughter and said, it "said Can you print this?" So when she gets home today, she's gonna print it for me. So I'll have it to have a pattern to look at. And I'll have to update you, date you later on it. I don't know if I could could show you the picture of it on my on my phone or not. Probably not. I've just had a crazy day. <laughs> that happens. It happens. All right. That's all for me today. Until I can check in with you later. Bye. Love y'all.